welcome back to Andy's VR Reviews. Today we're going to be taking a look at Primal Hunt, a new VR game developed by Phaser Lock Interactive, available on the Quest and Pico Store for $29.99. Phaser Lock Interactive was kind enough to give me four Quest 2 game keys, which I will be hiding throughout this video for you all to find. All I ask is if you claim one to let me know in the comments section down below so we can all know when they've all been found. I'm going to do a quick review and then actually show a hunt without any commentary. For the people who want to see some unedited gameplay, if you want to skip to that part, please feel free to utilize the chapters below. Without wasting any more time, let's dive in. In Primal Hunt, you take on the role of a hunter, using a bow and arrow as well as a cyber suit loaded with high-tech tools to track and take down 24 different kinds of dinosaurs across 10 different maps in 3 different environment styles. Hopping into the game, you begin playing by selecting which dinosaur you would like to hunt. Then you'll be teleported to its near location where your hunt will begin. It is not as easy as just walking around the map until the dinosaur appears though. You must rely on your stealth and tracking skills to avoid other dangers, collect health and ammo, search for clues, and overall survive the rough terrain. Once the dinosaur you are hunting has been killed, you can collect your winnings, search for the nearest teleporter using the minimap, and that will bring you back to the home base. At the home base, you can display the head of the hunted dinosaur in your trophy room. You can also upgrade your skill and weapon level, participate in some target practice, or continue on with the campaign. While there is a campaign, there is no real story to go with it. You do have a Scottish trainer that talks you through the game, but he's there more for tips and tricks rather than your entertainment. As you could see from the gameplay footage, Primal Hunt has a more cartoonish graphics style, however it's not for the faint of heart. The 17 plus M rating may be a tad excessive, but the goriness of the gameplay is undeniable. If for whatever reason you want a more kid-friendly version, the gore can be turned down in the settings. While I personally always prefer graphics that are as realistic as possible, the team at Phaser Lock Interactive claims the art style was a decision made an effort to maximize the environment size, which I could understand. One thing that bothered me was not having the ability to remove the heads-up display. I understand having a compass and being able to see your health and other info is important, however, there really should be an option to turn it off. I would personally rather have my field of view as clear as possible than have it open. Overall, I found Primal Hunt provided arcade style fun with an old school style of gameplay that does its best to immerse you into a world of prehistoric hunting if you let it. While Primal Hunt is usually not my ideal style of game, if you're a fan of hunting games, it might be worth checking out. Alright, I'm going to switch over to the actual hunt now, where the last of the game keys are hidden. The lush vegetation and open space of the Saber Highland were created to capture the imagination of the true outdoorsman. Located at one of the highest plateaus of the jungle, this fertile location has plenty of vegetation and open areas for larger roaming dinosaurs while providing cover and breeding areas and home to the saber-toothed tiger. Check your map for your first clue and good luck! That sample matches that of a Velociraptor. Welks are often targeted by packs of Pteranodon. More information is required for target triangulation.
You might want to look for some stealth areas. Turn on your Artemis and scan the area for any stealth volumes. marks around these bones indicate they fell from a great height. Continue to gather information for target location.
Marking them as corpse are consistent with Tyranodon attack patterns. Data compiled. Your map has been updated with a likely location for your quarry. Quite the battle to bring that winged reptile to the ground. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> 